Number 25, letter A. What is the internal resistance of a voltage source if its terminal voltage drops by 2 volts when the current supplied increases by 5 amps? All right. So obviously, if the current increases by 5, that means more current is flowing through the battery, and therefore whatever resistance that the uh, current has to overcome should then drop the amount of voltage that the battery is able to supply. So um, if that was confusing, uh, this won't be as confusing. So it's very simple. We can use Ohm's law. Watch, I is equal to V over R, and what I can I want to calculate the resistance, right? So resistance will equal V over I. Now I can simply add two changes in here. That the change in resistance divided by the change in current should be then proportional to the resistance, all right? That is being uh, experienced by the current and the voltage that's changing. In other words, it would then be equal to the internal resistance. So we simply would take 2 over 5, and that works out to be 0.4 ohms. Look at that. Boom. There it is. And then letter B. Can the EMF of the voltage source be found with the information supplied? Uh, no. Nope. It's just not, you know, you sit here all day try to figure it out. You cannot get down uh, to this um, EMF. All right. So, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Appreciate it. Please remember to help us out and subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Take care.